What's going on fam? This your boy T Spillin' here with a quick video. This is actually a response video to my sister uh, Tasha uh, trying to help her uh, add the intros and all that good jazz to her respective videos. So um, I'm actually going to use the video that I recorded yesterday uh, for the shout out Saturday as just an example. I'm not going to go too, too deep into how I do my productions because I don't want to lose her or anybody else. So I already have a uh, iMovie open. So um, Pretty much just go to new movie, uh, pick what theme you want. Like I say, you choose no theme or whatever. So, like I said, I will go with my default, which is uh, my favorite. This one right here. So, go ahead and click create and then just add a title. So, for mine, uh, I'll just uh, do SOS for sure for shout out Saturday. Just real quick video for you guys. Click OK. And it automatically is going to get everything generated from there. Um, there's so many different ways to import the media. I'm just going to do it the simple way. So I already have my intro right here. So pretty much just click on it. Oh, okay. I don't want to adjust it. Click on it and just drag it down. <clears throat> and like I said, if you want your intro to play first, there is the intro. And then uh, what you want to do is take <clears throat> your respective file, whatever the video is, and place that right after it. Do that. Now, one thing to remember when doing now, I'm not going to sit here and merge the uh, green screen and all that because that's a video for a different day. But if you guys look right here, when it starts, you see how the uh, effects fall right over the intro. If you want to keep that there, you can. Or what you can do is you can click on it and actually move it over and let it play over your uh, file and yeah turn off automatic content that just because pretty much what that does right there it at the very end let me kind of minimize this a little bit it does a whole directed by and I don't like that there because I, I, I like to put something else on the end not necessarily that but pretty much you know if you got if you do it that way uh, this is pretty much how it looks so I'll just let this uh, play right quick but that is pretty much it before I do the whole save export all that good jazz so What's up, everybody? It's your boy. I am back <clears throat> for shout out Saturday. All right, that's enough. Don't need to do no more. Pretty much, that's uh, pretty much how I do it. Of course, like I said, there's other effects that I add in, but uh, that's pretty much it. And that's uh, using it via iMovie. And to save and export, just come up here to this button right here, click on it, and that's a share. Um, if the video is longer than 15 minutes, you don't want to do a direct upload to YouTube. And I never do that anyway. But what I do is I click the file and then from there, uh, change the title and then it'll actually export it uh, to whatever folder that I need. And once it's exported, then uh, go to YouTube, click upload and then drag it over there and it uploads from there. So this is pretty much how to do uh, the video via iMovie. All right, you guys, I'm pretty much going to show you how to pretty much, like, you know, add the trailer and all that good jazz from uh, iMovie off of um, the iPhone if you have it. So what I did is I uploaded my file to Dropbox because it makes it easier for me to save it directly to my phone pretty much by clicking on it. OK, well, hold on. Hold on. Now. Click the little check up there. Move. I'm sorry. Share and choose the uh, save video link so and once you do that and it's saved and I actually have two files moved over if you're going to be using your iPhone to do the videos that's probably the best thing to do is actually already have it here and if you do record all your um, all your uh, videos on your phone then this just makes it easier open a buy movie click new project select movie select what type of uh, theme you want and pretty much from this uh, point on you're pretty much going to add the videos um, that you want in sequential order so 
tap to select we see do 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 videos yes recently added and I want to go ahead and add my trailer first my trailer is down at the bottom so and then hit the little drop down button that drops it down and then I can add another video which will pretty much be the actual video itself and that's pretty much it at this point <clears throat> uh, you can choose to play it but I'm just going to uh, hit done and then from here I'm going to hit the little uh, square with the up arrow and this will allow me to share it again if you're going to try to do a direct uh, upload from uh, iMovie to uh, YouTube the video at, uh, total has to be less than 15 minutes if not what I recommend is saving it as a file and then when you're done open up the YouTube app itself and then from there just do a direct upload where you pretty much let it do what it does from there so those are two ways to um, add a um, uh, what, what's the word I'm looking for? An intro to uh, your video using iMovie on uh, your Mac and also on the uh, iPhone. And I'm pretty sure it's the same on the iPad if you guys have an iPad too. And I do apologize for the uh, difference in the voice quality if there is one. And that's because I'm doing this with two different programs a couple different ways. So hopefully this helps all those who uh, wanted it slash uh, needed it. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Rate, comment, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you guys on this video. Peace.